Hello everyone, welcome to Han's Garage. Today I have this rim that I absolutely don't care about and I decided to see if I could spray paint it. So before I spray paint, I am going to sand down all the curb rashes and minor scratches just to make sure all the rim is clean and smooth for me to spray paint right over. So in order for me to sand down this rim, I am using 3M from 400 grit 800, 1000, 2000, 400 being the roughest and 2000 being the smoothest for the final finish. And then I'm going to spray paint using this black satin finish. I think I got this for about $5 and I'm going to see how it will come out. So let's get started. First, I'm going to clean it with this mother's aluminum wheel cleaner. I'm going to spray it first. And I'm going to let it sit for about a minute or two. And I'm going to clean it. And I'm going to rinse it with water. Okay, I've just finished cleaning the rim and I'm going to show you the condition of my rim is in right now. There are some couple of scratches here and there around the edge. And I'm going to sand it down and clean it one more time and then spray paint. So I'm starting with the 400 grit. Now I'm going to wet sand instead of dry sand. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to grind the edge of the rim so it's smoother and you can see how rough it is because of the carb rash. Now I'm going to use this grinding pad to make the edges smoother. Alright, so I've finished sending down everything and I'm going to paint now but before I paint I'm going to cover the tire all right I'm gonna put the first coat on Okay, now we're going to put on the second coat. I'm really getting into these edges. I'm going to let this dry for a little bit. Ready for the third coat.
I'm going to get a little closer for the third coat. I'm actually having a hard time painting these edges and I think I'm going to have to get closer. Looking really good right now. Now I'm going to let this dry for a couple minutes. This is looking really, really good. I'm going to put more coats on. All right, it's all dry and I'm going to take the tape off. Wow, just look at this $5 paint job. Can you believe it? $5 guys. So I just put the M sticker back on and what I'm seeing right here, I couldn't get it down smooth enough because the scratch was pretty deep but other than this area I feel like the rest of the area is really really smooth and I think sanding down with patience and getting all the edges and grooves really really helped for this project and I did not expect this job at all but here it is you guys can see so if you have any questions please leave a comment below subscribe for upcoming videos and I'll see you guys next time